Well, I also would want to thank the panelists for um, two great presentations, which I think really um, generated um, robust discussion about you know, the thing that resonated with me is patient engagement and how actionable is actionable and how the definition of actionable really differs from the perspective of patients and providers. Um, the other thing that resonated for me with the discussion was the importance of, diagnos of diagnosis and you know, not just for the sake of diagnosis, but that diagnosis has the potential to lead to new treatments, um, but that certainly getting diagnosis um, in and of itself is important. I think we also had a lot of um, interesting conversation about the need to study the impact of diagnosis and, and um, the subsequent outcomes it has in terms of being beneficial or not beneficial uh, for patients from, diff from different backgrounds and uh, different clinical experiences. We had a lot of conversation about the importance of patient engagement um, and really working more actively to engage um, patients and families to leverage their energy and clinical um, experiences with the disease from the day-to-day -day experience um, into the next iteration of CSER. Um, I think the point of who controls and owns information was really important, um, especially as it related to Matt's experience with using um, the internet as a tool for genomics. And the examples you described, I think, were really outstanding about how you can um, use the internet to identify others in the, and to create a community around a particular disorder. I think the other thing that really resonated with me was um, how to package information to benefits patients best. Um, there was a lot of conversation about the range of information in terms of its certainty, and one of the things that CSER has really been effective at is how to think about packaging this information and how to deliver that clinically um, into patient care, and I think that's an area for um, future, future endeavors. Did I miss anything? I don't think so. That was great. Okay, thanks. Hey, I think for the break. Well, no, not break, the next Ooh, section. We're not, break, we're not breaking <laughs> just yet. <laughs> ready for a break. <laughs> Ben's ready for a break. Okay. Um, thank you to the panel. So next we have our increasing ancestral, socioeconomic, and clinical diversity session, which will be co-moderated by Pilar Osorio and Greg Cooper, ta with talks given by Jim Evans and Carlos Bustamante on the phone. So um, bear with us. I, I think we um, are in the process of getting Carlos on the phone to join us.